Hey, so what's up? I'm just gonna do a uh, live video, but I wanted to update anybody who cares that IL-2 Battle of Stalingrad has been massively upgraded. It's got a huge graphical update. We are now running this game with Direct X11. I get 60 frames per second. Graphics are on high. I can finally really experience the game the way it's meant to be experienced and enjoy it the way it's meant to be enjoyed. And I gotta tell you right off the bat, the combat and the flying, oh, it's such a great simulation. I, I played it for the first time last night and I was legitimate giddy. Like, I was like laughing and crying and like, it's just so fun. I was so excited. And so, I'm just, we're just doing a little quick mission right here against some uh, 109 F4s. I'm in a Yak-1 and uh, this is totally live. So if I get shot down, then you uh, get to see see it all unfold but maybe I'll get lucky and get some kills there are currently three BF 109 F4s engaging three yaks I think that's the 109 right there climbing up towards me I'm gonna try and get him to stall if he does I'm gonna come back down on him oh yeah oh yeah he's, he's screwing up he's jacked up I have the, the AI set on uh, ace so this is the highest difficulty, although sometimes they make mistakes, which is realistic because sometimes pilots in real life will make rookie mistakes, and then you want to seize upon those mistakes. Alright, overshot that, I'm just going to do a high yo-yo. Now guys, I'm no expert at this game, so I feel the urge to critique my flying. It's, it's all good, because... I'm still learning this game. The mechanics and the flight models are extremely different from War Thunder, which is something I'm thoroughly used to. But I'm definitely getting good at this because basically the one thing that I've uh, uh, figured out about this game is um, it's less surgical than War Thunder. I, I don't know, maybe it's just like my play style. But this game, oh dear! This game, this game is way more about uh, snapshots and uh, not zooming in all the time. Uh, I have the FOV uh, fully back and uh, that way I can see my surroundings. Uh, what's interesting is that with the graphical update uh, it makes that actually easier, which is great. Nothing. Stalled my airplane out doing that. But yeah, it's more about all this, it's more about the snapshots and actually uh, hitting your opponent's engine or wingtips to uh, to get them to uh, be um, flying injured and then you can actually move in for those more sur surgical shots excuse me and uh, yeah that's really basically the name of the game one of the biggest things I've noticed right now is the the way the ballistics look now in this game are phenomenal they are so 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 good all like the, the way the tracers look the smoke trails, everything, the animations, um, when you watch people explode on the ground now, it's perfectly smooth. Before, it was very choppy. I don't know what, what the deal was, but that's because I guess it was on uh, DirectX 9, but now it's, it's super, super buttery, and it just looks so smooth. The immersion is all there now. Alright, guys, here we go. We're going to make this happen. I'm going to throttle back, make sure I do not overshoot this time. Flaps and just do snapshots. I want that, I want I want to injure his engine because once I injure that engine, it's literally a matter of time before he's just, yeah, see right there? Now it's just a matter of time. Now I can play the waiting game. I can continue to check my six, make sure there aren't any other 109s in the area. And I can basically just wait it out. That way I can conserve ammo and keep an eye on myself just in case. Because eventually, his engine is just going to fail. It's just going to seize up. And once it seizes up, I'm going to get a really good surgical shot. My plane is stalling out, though. Didn't see if any hits were there. I'm going to go for the machine gun. Yep, buzz him. Look at that, look at that. Oh, right on the fuselage. Engine's on fire. See you later, dude. That's basically the name of the game. You really, I can't stress enough how much you just want to injure your opponents and then finish them off. There he goes, he bails out. Guys, watch watch this new animation with the crash. 
so much better. Uh, he didn't explode that time. Okay. Ooh, flips. Alright guys, I'm just going to end there because that was just a quick little update. If anybody plays this game, please message me, let me know. Uh, multiplayer is very difficult to play solo, so it's essential that I play with somebody with comms. And uh, if you're interested, just please let me know. Alright guys, have an awesome day.